Hey, happy client check-in. I Tomorrow is the 4th, and I'm sure everybody will be enjoying their family, so I kind of wanted to move the client check-in to today, and this is late notice, but I wanted to talk to you guys about a couple things and give you some skills for this week. So it, the social gatherings and the way our culture is, a lot of times it's about the food. And I just want to give you the uh, empowerment title, uh, the new idea of being able to make things the way you want and building new traditions with your family that are focused on each other and connection. Um, you know, what do we really gather with families around? W what is it for? It is to connect. And a lot of times we lose that with making things fun with food and, and having the focus be with the food. Um, and how can we shift that to be able to really serve, um, the deeper meaning of what this is all about. So I just want to encourage you, there's a plan of action sheet that I'm going to locate in the details of this video and in the client text that is so helpful. So like, what is it that you're anticipating? So like going to the barbecue, what is it that um, are possible barriers that would keep you from your goals? Um, maybe like making food could be an obstacle for you that like if you're supposed to bring cookies maybe don't make them maybe buy the store-bought kind because you won't eat them right that's like totally something I would do so just kind of thinking about what is it that are going to be possible barriers maybe it's what people say or what people will think and and then planning a strategy for success so like how can you plan for success in those moments maybe you can tell people what you're doing beforehand and just say, Hey, I'm really working on balancing my blood sugars. I would love for you guys to help me stay on track with, um, if you don't offer me stuff like that would be so helpful to me. So like tell them how they can help you and just making it light and fun and not a big deal. And if you're saying, I can't, I can't, I can't in your head versus shifting into the, I'm choosing this, or I can do that later, or I don't want it right now. Like, and getting to that place too mentally takes time. But like, what would the healthiest version uh, of you be thinking if they could think anything they wanted to think that would serve them? Okay. So I want you to kind of go into those pieces. And then I also um, have some recipes that I would love to share with you for, for the fourth. And so definitely check those out. Let me know um, if you can chat today. I really would love to touch base with you. And it's going to be kind of hit or miss, but let's try. I would love to do that. And then also, um, you guys, I'm just letting you know, in July, they're going to release some new stuff with Optavia for Ultra Health and um, that are is just going to like totally blow your mind. So I, just be prepared for that. It's coming when com convention happens. And if any of my clients or, or anybody I know wants to come to convention, it's in July and I have an opening in my room. So if you want a roomie, let's do it. So hope you guys are having a great day. And... Um, Happy 4th of July. Celebrate the freedom that maybe you're experiencing now that you haven't experienced for a long time. Uh, I'll just speak on that quickly. You guys, really, the freedom that we really desire is freedom right here. Freedom in our mindset and wearing the clothes that we want to wear. Um, it, it's, it makes a difference when we just know that we're keeping promises to ourselves. It frees up the mindset space that really holds us captive so often. So um, remember the freedoms that are important to you and being able to spend the time the way you wish you could spend it. Like that's why I'm so grateful for coaching. I will forever coach because it's changed my life in being able to really have that deep purpose and meaning behind serving people and, and being the best, highest version of myself with personal development. So anyway, hope you're having a great day. This is a longer message, but I just had a lot to say for the 4th of July and um really contemplate what freedom means to you in your health journey.